Okay, y'all. Um, this is for the GoFundMe um, com um, campaign, the donation site. You all guys know GoFundMe. But um, this is for the news outlets who um, just reported today that GoFundMe um, is going to change the policy and um, uh, the campaigns they are running and donations are going to run. Um, However, on Channel 13, where I'm Rochester, New York station, they said um, they should go to the source of the campaign who is um, raising the money. That's the problem where um, w, uh, where I, um, back from Rochester, um, the day Rochester and um, Fox and um, also WROC Channel 8, that's the issue. The people who are doing the funds and donation for the people they're raising for, that should not be the problem. That should not be the cause of them changing rules. They should change rules and asking the people they're raising the money for, for, because, um, like in Farbury, to run a um, world um, case which Channel 13 just brought up um, tonight. Um, but the thing is, the, his family, his drug family, had absolutely zero clue, no idea that this Rochester school teacher was doing this. This is what the problem is with um, GoFundMe. The people who are raising the money for the people, I don't think they even tell the people they're doing it. Or like for this um, veteran, um, which this couple, the latest issue about controversy and, and GoFundMe is the um, women, women we help a couple months ago, gave her the last twenty dollars and his own wallet. Um, gave her the money to buy gas. However, they set up a GoFundMe page for him, which in last week's newspaper I also saw. He didn't ask for it. He didn't want it. So it's like. These people who are raising the funds aren't going to the people they're raising for. Because, like Trevor Woe, the person who was raising up money did not go to the family. And if by chance the family wanted a funeral like I said on that GoFundMe um, campaign, and I did say, when go um, simpler, smaller, something that they can handle. I didn't say the last part, but I did say simple and smaller and um, go for an, um, a cheap way, which is so not a racist freaking thing. And people took it as a racist comment. I didn't say anything about blacks, I didn't say anything about Hispanics or whites. I just said the truth and I felt in my gut and heart that the family had no idea she was doing this, which I found out later that week. She, the mother of Trevon, had no clue she was doing that. Maybe she wanted a simple and small, no hassle, no big crowds. People who are doing the GoFundMe campaigns and raising money for people, you guys need to think of that family. You need to think of what they wanted, instead of doing it behind their backs and not saying anything. Thank you, and by the way,